As gas prices inch up, police say they're seeing an increase in reports about gas being stolen right out of people's cars. Tonight, Action 7 News reporter Laura Terrain introduces us to recent victims who have some warnings for you. Yeah, it's, it's, it says it's empty. Ed Sanchez said he knew something was wrong while driving with his wife when she pointed out his gas light was on. And I thought to myself, it can't be. I should have at least three quarters. Turns out the tank was empty. A thief snuck into his carport overnight in order to go underneath his truck and cut the gas line. Sanchez says he realized he had a real problem while filling up with more gas. The fuel started pouring out of the bottom of his truck. If there was a bit of spark around there, there could have been a you know fire and explosion. I could have been badly burned or killed. Unfortunately, this problem is not new. Action 7 News told you about this guy caught on camera slicing through a fence in order to cut the gas line on a daycare van. Director April Vargas said this is the second time this happened in a week and the 13th time since November. Her staff often doesn't realize they're out of gas until it's too late. They go on their field trip and they get stranded. Albuquerque police say they are seeing an increase in reports of gas theft. Usually, typically, you see this kind of stuff happen when, when gas hits three, four dollars a gallon. And if fuel prices continue to climb, they're warning everyone to keep cars locked up in a garage if you can. Laura Terrain, KOAT Action 7 News.